So, I found this tabloid, and I don't know if it's true or not, but the claim is that a mother was actually arrested over tw a Twitter battle with a transgender woman because she called her a man. Now, this is the mother in question. Apparently, she's 38. I don't know. She doesn't really look like she's 38, so maybe maybe this is fake. I don't, I, I don't really know. This is being spread around the internet, though. It's almost like wildfire. It's on Daily Mail, The Blaze, Daily Caller, uh, a whole bunch of other websites. But they're not very they're not very valid websites. And I really want to know if this is true or not. Because this is this would be insane that, you know, just because he, they disagreed about whether or not like cause this person used to be a man and is now technically a woman as I guess. I I you know, eh. Uh you know, technically still got the chromosomes of a man. I mean, that's just, it is what it is. You can't have children because she was once a he and, you know, biology and stuff. But, you know, she she wants to be she and do all the transgender stuff. I mean, I don't really care. Do what makes you happy. But the fact that, you know, someone had an opinion about it and that they went and arrested this mother, if this story is true, went and arrested this mother in front of her children is uh insane uh apparently it is a toxic debate and harassing the fame i mean like is it actually really coming because this apparently happened in the uk uh, i definitely know this shit would not fly in the united states like we would laugh and be like ha that's not gonna happen i don't at least i would assume so i would hope so if not i mean that's just I mean, you know, if you don't like what someone's saying to you on fucking Twitter, there's this thing called a block button, and you could just use it and be like, hey, I'm not going to talk to you anymore. I mean, I don't feel like hearing your opinion anymore. I mean, freedom of speech is pretty nice. It's a pretty good thing to have. I, mean, I like the freedom of speech. Pretty good stuff. But if this is true, though, it's like a complete degradation of, like, human rights that someone can't have an opinion on something that's so opinionated such a opinionated topic that it because i mean this is the first time in real history where such a widespread use of you know gender transformation is is taking place and a lot of people are going to have opinions on that and you know people have to accept that if, if you're a transgender person and you decide to switch uh your gender identities and even get gender reassignment surgery, you have to expect the fact that some people are not, are not going to like it or some people are going to say certain comments about it. I, mean, I really don't care. I do think like if, if you were once a man and you're now a woman and you're trying to sleep with me, I, I feel like I should know that you were once a man. I mean, I, I feel like it's my personal right to know that. That's how I feel. I feel like you as a person should be a good person and notify me of that. Because some, I mean, some people are into that. I'm not into that. I mean, eventually, you know, especially if it's a relationship. Because, you know, one day I might want to have kids and you just can't have kids because you were once a man. I mean, that's... It's just, I don't know. It's just not what I want. It's just not me. It's not for me. You know, you can do whatever you want to do. I, don't, I mean, I don't care. But me, personally, it's kind of like, eh, nah, this is not, not for me. Not, not, nope, not a... So, but let me know what you guys think about this craziness in the in the comments. And if, if someone really knows if this is true or not, like, please let me know because I, I can't really find anything about it. I, I know, like, the Daily Mail is kind of a tabloid thing, but apparently they have true stories. And then sometimes they have stories that are just misrepresented. And sometimes they have just false, false stories. And I don't know. I, I just don't know. Either way, it's 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 fucking insanity, if it's real. So, if you guys have heard any anything like this actually happening in the UK, and you're from the UK, also comments, hit them comments up. Let me know, and also hit that like and subscribe button, cause that shit's nice. All right, guys, deuces.